What's going on adventurers? So today we are at Longhorn Steakhouse, which is one of our favorite places to eat. We just absolutely love this place. And we pretty much always get the same thing every time, but as a lot of you know, um, last night Lisa was diagnosed with diabetes and from what the doctor said it was pretty severe. Now, we have been hearing different things. We have been hearing that there's a possibility that the infection caused her sugar levels to be that astronomical. So, um, you know, we're gonna definitely keep the faith that everything's gonna be okay. Um, but in the meantime, we are adjusting, both of us are adjusting our diets so that we are eating keto-friendly food, low-carb, and let me show you what we ordered. This is, this is really exciting, guys. We are gonna get through this together. You guys are gonna join us on this journey. Um, we are gonna go to different restaurants. We're gonna show you guys what you can order um, that is diabetes friendly. So let's do this guys. I'm gonna show you what we ordered and I mean, it's mostly the same stuff that we get, just a couple modifications. So, you know, I think we got this, Lise. All right, so this is my salad. Everything about it is normally what they give you. Only difference is there are no croutons. So I'm even gonna put my, my blue cheese dressing right there, bam. Looks so good. I love blue cheese. All right, so Lisa's okay. over here, guys. She's doing okay. Uh, tell us how you're feeling. I'm not going to speak for you. Tell um, us how you're feeling. As far as my arm tissue, it feels so much better. Yay. The pain level is down to almost just noticeable. That's amazing. That is amazing. The surgeon did a great job. So next thing is we were so hungry. So Jen Googled about... Where to eat would be the best for like blue pork. So apparently, um, steak, fish, chicken are some really good options. The number is 15, and if you Google like steak, it might be what would you say it was like four or two? Yeah, very low, very low, very low carb. Very low. I think any meats are low carb unless um, you just want to be sure to steer clear of breading. The breading. Yeah. yeah. And avoid the. Doing great. Thank you. Um, you want to avoid like baked potatoes, sodas, um, bread, so we didn't get the bread today. And got, you know, salad, it was interesting, Jen Googled about salads, and I don't know if it's just different ones, but some of them can be very high for Yeah, I don't know why, I don't know if it's the uh, croutons yeah. or... Well, we got crouton free. We actually asked here in Longhorn for a keto menu, but... They don't have, there is something online, it may be older, but they actually, the waitress knew about uh, take all croutons, and we got the mushroom dish. Which yeah, look at these mushrooms, guys. These, these are awesome. Are amazing. So you get this without the um, breadcrumbs, she said, the waitress said. And that makes, and the mushrooms are, it's in like 0.6. It's like one of the best vegetables you can eat for a low carb. Yeah. And it has cheddar cheese, which is also very low. I'm not trying to think of that. And actually, uh, cheddar cheese is really healthy for you, too. Yeah. So that's your okay. And then the steak will be coming. But yeah. So we'll, we asparagus. Yeah. And we did get asparagus for our side. Now, here's the thing. Of course, when you're in a steakhouse, you're going to want to have a baked potato or a sweet potato, at least. But, you know, it's really not a good idea, especially now in this stage uh, that we're dealing with because we have to kind of figure out, we need to get a baseline, like exactly where she's at. Last night was kind of just, it was just a finger stick test, so we're waiting for the blood work to come back. Um, but, you know, it does say that if you're diabetic, you can have like a half of a baked potato. Just, we're gonna wait for a little while and see where she is, but, you know, we really appreciate all your prayers, guys. Thank you so much. Please continue to keep us in your prayers, though. Lisa's got this. This check right here is tough. She sat in an emergency room with a broken femur for six hours without any pain medication, so she can certainly get through this. I know she's uh, serious when she takes her glasses off. I don't know. Serious business. I'm serious. This is next thing is the hair. I gotta get that under control. <laughs> yeah. The You're fine. Oh well. Everybody just wants you to get better. That's all. That. Including me. So I'm gonna treat her to a delicious lunch right now. And we will show you guys as the steak and the um, asparagus comes out. Steak? Steak? <laughs> well, you guys can see she's in much better spirits today, so that's awesome. That's the Lisa I know and love. 
here it is guys this is what we both ended up getting it's the renegade sirloin with asparagus Lisa's cutting into hers. Does it look like it's perfectly done? <laughs> Cut that energy back. So get your motor running. Head out on the highway. You know what I didn't ask for? They just use salt and pepper here. Oh, yeah. Good? Well, there you go. There is your diabetes friendly meal. Super keto, is this super keto? I mean, yeah, it's delicious looking. Mm. This is what I needed after your first Just what I needed. <laughs> it, it, it's so good, you're not gonna know that it's good for you. <laughs> well, that's always good. It is good, that's that's the whole point. Look at these. Look at those delicious asparagus stalks. Yummy. Look at the delicious asparagus. So guys, I'm getting ready to dig into this. It looks so good. We'll see you guys a little bit later. I don't know what we're going to get into today. I do know we need to go pick up all Lisa's prescriptions from the pharmacies. Raptor Mama and Wilderness Dave. And... No reception. <laughs> so how do I say your name again? I don't want to get it wrong this time. Try and loss. Try and loss. T-R-I-A-N-L-O-S. Awesome. So be sure to go subscribe to Try and loss. Currently we are walking around Home Depot with Raptor Mama, Wilderness Dave, and Trian Loss. So, um, who is that peeping around the corner? <laughs> it's Raptor Mama. We are in Florida. <laughs> we, they've only been here a couple hours and we're already having so much fun. Two hours. How long? Two hours. Okay, two hours. That's a couple hours. Yeah, two hours of sleep. Oh yeah, they only had two hours of sleep. So Lisa's not with us currently. She's at home resting where she needs to be. We just got done eating a delicious barbecue dinner. That ain't them. That ain't them, Mom. There they are. So Raptor Mama has told me numerous times that Wilderness Dave can fix almost anything. And he's already got some projects he's working on for us. Well, I don't know if they're standard or metric sizes, so that'll be through both. So one of them is standard, one of them is metric, and then the Torx. The, the What's the third one? Torx. Stars. Superstar. Right, let's go find the project. So guys, I've been doing really good sticking to a low carb diet, trying to enjoy the change with Lisa, so that she doesn't feel so alone in it. But that was until tonight. Sorry. Tonight I actually, I had some french fries, which was really bad. And I did get a corn muffin, but I did not eat it yet. I'm gonna take it home in moderation. And I did have sweet tea, which I probably shouldn't have had sweet tea. Well, actually it was half and half, so Dave was good. He got half and half, so I got the half and half too. And it was really good. So we're looking at brackets right now. This is for a, like a, a kitchen drawer. Yep. What do we have there? A non-broken bracket. Awesome. All right. You I can't wait in. to see it. In action. <laughs> Mom, you're fogged up neat just like me. <laughs> We're so goofy. <laughs> Athena! Where are you, princess? What if I told you that your grandmother, Raptor Mama, Wilderness Dave, and Dean, aka Triad Loss, brought you a present? What would you say about that? What would you say? What do you have to say? Is there anything that you'd like to? Oh. Well, she's gonna be good, I think. She, she's showing everybody that she could be a good girl and she wants her toy. Athena, get on the couch. Good girl. Are you ready for your present? Are you ready? They got you a really awesome present and I've seen it already. I've already seen it. But you have no idea. You have no idea what's coming your way. I have seen it myself in person. And you are getting ready to be excited with what's to come. Are you ready? Are you ready for your present? Are you? Are you? Oh, 
<laughs> I guess that's a yes. Who's gonna present it to you? Is it Raptor Mama? Is it Tryon Loss? <laughs> Raptor Mama got the goods. It's Dave. Okay. Wilderness Dave, you are being paged. <laughs> uh oh, Athena's already seen the goods. She is mouthing it. What you got? Big old carrot. Don't worry, she'll get it. I don't know if she likes it. <laughs> She's just a little bit obsessed already. <laughs> Say thank you. She wants to see how many times she can train you to pick it up for. Oh, <laughs> <Yep>. <laughs> Say thank you. She's like, I know there's another one. Huh? I think there's three, four three, in there. Three. three or four. Watch her. She'll, she will find them and she will pull them right out of there. Does she really? Yes, yeah, she does. She, I got this really cool turtle toy for her in the pool. Then she ripped its head off and pulled the dang squeaker out of it. Oh <laughs> I need to get her another pool toy. We can do that when you guys are down. It entices her to get in the water. What you got? Look at you, aren't you? Did you check Athena! Where are you, princess? <laughs> Give her kisses. Give her kisses. <laughs> So Athena's getting spoiled, guys. She just got back from a walk with these guys. How far did you take her? Around the whole block. Yeah? Awesome. Yeah. She needs training and walking. Yeah, she does. She loves to be all over the place. Yeah. She's like, I'll get it myself. See? <laughs> Look at that. Look how smart this dog is. I don't need nobody. She plays catch with herself with her toys. You get that carrot. It's a really cool toy. It's nice and big. It's like her size. It's not gonna get lost in the shuffle. I don't think it will. She said, I'm just gonna lay on it. I'm a, it's gonna double as a pillow. That's some squeaky pillow you got there, Missy. Get your toy. Get it. Oh my. That's my foot. Yeah, she's trying to rip it open now. Take that toy back up on the sofa. Up. Athena, up. Look at you. Aren't you just the queen of Sheba? <laughs> <laughs> she has her own sofa.